Hi guys, Glam by Nicole's Eyes back with a fall makeup look, kind of a cut crease if you rather. I have one eye done already. I'm going to do this eye on the video. I had messed up. I went and did all my, comp I did this eye first. So it was supposed to be a two eye thing and, or a, um, I was going to do both eyes on camera and wound up uh, doing one eye. So I went into a brown and we're going to slowly start cutting the crease out with that brown. Kind of carve it out with eyeshadow. And make that little wing while we're doing it. Just like that. Boy, that brown really picks up. Seems like it's easier on the left eye than it is on that eye, kind of. And then I'm going to go into this really pretty orange right here. And we're going to line it underneath that. Underneath that line we used to cut our crease with. The orange is going to go under it. kind of blending into that brown. And that orange eyeshadow has to be blended in with that brown. Really pretty. You see, it's kind of really pretty. Probably shouldn't have made, the, <laughs> made it come out too far. I probably should not have, but I did. Well, I'm wacky in that sense anyway. You guys all know that. I just wanted it to look pretty, you know. It's just been a little while since I've done a cut crease and I'm not using somebody else's video to do it. I'm just kind of going on my own here. And I'm gonna go into this pretty coppery color here. That, this just Morphe, Morphe's really good guys. And we're going to put that on the lid. Ooh, I love how it looks so foiled. I love that. And now I'm going to go into this rose, rose gold kind of color here. By the way, you guys, this is the Morphe 35O palette. It has shimmers, foils, and... Uh, satin finishes and I'm gonna put that on the inside wrong eye <laughs> I'm gonna put that on the inner corner there wasn't much to this look at all like to me it kind of come together real easily and I'm putting that color on the brow bone as well. And then I'm going to go back in with this brush and finish up the eyes. I'm going to go into this brown here 
and run it up underneath the lower lash line because that's the brown I used to carve out the crease. I mean, because there's like two ways you cut your, you could cut your crease. So this is one way of, this was one way of doing it. And then the other way of doing it is um, with the concealer. Yeah, I probably should have went in with a concealer and cleaned up underneath those harsh lines, but I didn't. Now we got that going. Um, I'm gonna go in with this liner, this copper liner here. Just to wake up the under part of the eye to make it look more awake. There we go. And now we're going to do some mascara. And this is a beautiful palette, guys. Like, I really love this 35-0 palette. You can do so much with it. It's versatile. Very versatile. Next look I do, I'm gonna put falsies on. <laughs> and I didn't use a primer either, so I hope that these foiled shades don't run into each other. And that is the finished eye look. I think it turned out really pretty. Um, I need some lipstick to finish off the look. Got it on my lip, on my teeth. I hope you guys all like the video, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and, and as always, love you.